Attack Surface Reduction Rule 2 Block Adobe Reader from Creating Child Process Now this rule targets the behavior wherein child process creation from Adobe Reader is blocked preventing Adobe Reader to act as an attack vector. The attack technique which has been targeted is 1204 which is user execution malicious file and the mitigation ID is 1040. Now this mitigation ID is very common that exists between multiple attack surface reduction rules but just for your reference you can officially read the documentation which is available on the attack technique website and as you can see over here it shows 1040 and the behavior which has been targeted is user execution malicious file now if i'll scroll down again and go to this particular section you can see it is clearly mentioned over here on windows 10 which obviously means now on windows 11 as well various attack surface reduction rules can be enabled to prevent execution of potential malicious executable files okay from deployment methods standpoint, this rule can be deployed from Microsoft Intune, Group Policy, PowerShell, whereas this rule cannot be deployed from Microsoft Endpoint Configuration Manager. From a notification standpoint, both EDR and user notification is generated if the rule is triggered, provided the rule is implemented in block mode. Now let's say if you want to know rule specific events, you can use these two queries. Again, access device event table and use the action type attribute to query values like ASR, Adobe Reader, child process audited or blocked. That's it.